Hey guys, I'm Rob Morali. Hope you guys are audio well today. So we have the brand new batch at Teaser and there's a lot going on in this Teaser and I can already tell it's going to really irritate me. But, hats off to back chat. I'm proud that you guys are talking about another important topic. Two great topics with great substance and great density for people to go into. There's a lot of weird things people are saying that I'm beginning to see. First and foremost, um, it looks like everybody is going to be disagreeing with um, Adrian. People who are dedicated to speak to you. So you have school counsellors. Hold on. You get, hold on. Hold on, wait. Well, that is the biggest bullshit I've ever heard of. However, I think it's way too early to say that all of us are bullying him, all of us are jumping on him. We have to obviously wait until and see the substance of what these people say, who's making a practical point, who's not, and base it off that. But what I'm seeing from right now, looks like everybody's very quick to, you know, disagree with him. We have, we have people like Lucas who are saying there are some people who eat, some people who don't eat, and people who don't eat piss me off. Cannot eat, but there are people that can eat, and they're choosing not to eat. That is going to aggravate you. Like, there's a lack of substance within his mind frame when it comes to mental illnesses, and if this reoccurs in this entire episode, and if this is what the majority will talk about, it really is going to irritate me because me, myself, I want to work in a mental health practice, so this type of stuff is literally going to irritate me a lot. If it comes to that, I want to go in. Let me tell you something now. I literally was just stopped rising for eating disorders. I've got an exam on that, and if he has just said right now, I think he's just said about how oh, some people eat, some people don't eat, why do people eat? It irritates me. The lack of complex knowledge that you do not obtain really is going to just irate my entire head if this is a continued theme of this entire show, of this entire debate. Then we have Romla crying. I just said to her, with hardship comes ease and let's just leave it with God. And I don't know why she's crying. She's probably either most likely relating it to a situation in her life where somebody related to this topic and it has her. I doubt it's to do with anyone on the show or cast, but we'll never know. We'll see what happens. And then we have Nini on the show. It looks like she's making a good point. What you're doing is being sympathetic, not telling them, oh, but look, look at the other side. Sometimes some people just need a little bit of love. When you see Nini on a teaser, there's an association with Nini and nonsense. However, it looks like she's making a good point. We've got Reva there, which I'm happy to see. And um, she's looking good. And um, we have Elsa talking about her, a lack of depth, again, a knowledge of suicide and, and you know, Adrian trying to give them the information that they need and they're all depleting his information and regarding it as bullshit, as Google says, and I don't like that. But we're going to see how that carries on. But as of right now, the main things to look forward to is the fact that they're talking about a great topic. Nunu is possibly making sense. The lack of knowledge from Esther and Lucas when it comes to suicide and eating disorders, overall prevalence of mental disorders, and the fact that they don't understand that some people might not eat, may not want to, for a very different reason that you can't comprehend yourself because of the lack of knowledge that you have. We also have Romla crying. Why is she crying? What's upset her? Someone in the cast? I doubt it. Probably someone of her friends or past situations. Then we've got Adrian making great points, but he's being shut down, remarked as bullshit, which is actually quite rude. Um, and, we have some, and we have him also talking about counsellors and so forth, etc. And him also bring the third factor when Esther was talking about suicide, he was like, you don't know, you don't know. And it's true. There's so many different reasons that we don't know, that we think we do. We think we know everything because we put, we put things in a box. So people go through so much and so much is going through someone's mind that you don't know what's happening sometimes. You are okay, okay? You, you, you haven't wanted to kill yourself. Or you, haven't you don't know like that, that. Esther. You don't know that. So I think he has a point there, but this is just my presumptions for what I've seen from the teaser. Things might be completely different. We don't know. Hopefully, it, it, hopefully there's no form of bullying tendencies that have happened previously and hopefully, you know, sometimes Lucas does make a lot of sense on the show and sometimes he doesn't. So hopefully this is an episode where he does make sense, but from what I'm seeing, it looks like he doesn't and I'm not going to take nonsense, but I'm here to also see what Reba says and we've got Corey talking about somebody cutting up, I don't know, so the depth of these topics are going to go in. Stay tuned for my Bachelor review coming out this Thursday of this particular episode hit me up on my snapchat my instagram my twitter my website and please subscribe to my youtube if you enjoy my reviews my teaser reviews and etc etc you guys wanted me to review the teasers so i thought you know what i'm going to just try and start doing that as well just to reflect on the coming possible storylines that we might be able to see and that we should stay tuned to and be open to when watching the episode about these different things and if these things will advance if these will progress and what we're what we're thinking might happen might happen or not so I think it's good to review teasers like this as well, so we can be to stay, just have be aware and be vigilant of possible topics and problems. But yes, let me know what you guys think. Hit me up on my social media credentials. Subscribe if you guys want to. Have a nice day, and I'll catch you guys soon.